Settler of the 52nd and others, a resolution recognizing the anesthesiology assistance of Georgia and for other purposes. Whereas anesthesia assistants work in the physician-led anesthesia care team to deliver high-level anesthesia to care to patients, and whereas the, there are approximately 900 anesthesia assistants currently licensed in Georgia with 10 anesthesia programs across the country, including two in this state. And whereas anesthesia assistants provide quality proven anesthesia while helping to keep medical services affordable and efficient. Now, therefore, be it resolved by the Senate that the members of this body recognize the anesthesia assistants of Georgia for their dedication to the health and well-being of the citizens of this state. Mr. President, this completes the order. That's good. Is there objection to adoption of the resolution? The chair hears none, and the resolution is adopted. It's great um, to have these wonderful Georgians here. I asked them if they were going to put us to sleep, and they said, not only if you want us to, and I nominated about uh, 20 of you senators to be put to sleep. The chair recognizes the senior senator from the 52nd to recognize our special Georgians. Thank you, Mr. President. As you know, now there's she, uh, two ways I can put you to sleep, um, okay. and I'll try not to do it up here today with, with my speaking. It's great to have um, our anesthesia providers here today. If you look outside the Senate, I think probably the largest portrait on the wall to the left out there is Crawford Long, who we consider, many of us, the father of anesthesia. He, he also uh, gave his name to the hospital, the first one I trained at though now it's called Emory Midtown. And um, uh, he might tell you that consciousness is overrated. I don't know. <laughs> but uh, we um, are proud to have uh, our state officers back here, uh, some of them, Katie Monroe, Chris Tindall, Gina Scarborough, Eric Hale, Joy Russ-Massell, the president of our organization. She'll speak briefly. Well, I know we've got quite a few students and providers from our two universities that train in the state of Georgia, Emory University and South University here. So those in the gallery, I would ask you to stand up at this time that are here. And with that, I'll turn it over to our president. Thank you, Senator Hosteller, for the resolution and the recognition. I am honored to serve as president of the Georgia Academy of Anesthesiologist Assistants, representing over a thousand AAs here in Georgia. For over 50 years, AAs have provided quality anesthesia care through the physician-led anesthesia care team model to Georgia citizens and VAs across the nation. We look forward to visiting with you, answering your questions, and I think it's important that I remind you that we are still the only healthcare profession not seeking to expand our scope of practice. Thank you for your public service and thank you for your time this morning. All right.